hello to all my beautiful subscribers welcome back to my channel so we're gonna start off with some messages let's see what's going on in love for you guys okay and it's crazy because this song by party next door came on called thirsty he was like i want to love you girl i want to love you girl. i want to love you girl i want to love you you gotta listen to it. it's called thirsty okay so you got people that's thirsting after you or, or thirst trapping or something. I don't know what's going on. But let's see. So we guys, angels, ancestors of the highest white light. What messages do we have? Let's see what's going on, y'all. But that's the collective need to know. So we got... <laughs> so someone could have linked up with your friend. Oh, this one went a whole nother way. But you could have known this because you already freed yourself from the situation, okay? Or switch roles. Take away where it resonates. Okay? Spirit is saying if you haven't, it's time for you to see things for what they are and take back control of your life. You do have true love around you or in your energy, okay? But this person is not willing to come in or come around, male or female, until you let go of something. Whether it's from the past or let go of mindset or let go of something you're attached to that you're holding on to because you want to flirt with this person and reconcile with this person because y'all both calling each other and y'all both manifesting one another one another with this calling in your soulmate okay to give this connection a chance with this but in order to do so y'all are willing to stay optimistic but this let your friends help you with unrequited love this give me like somebody friend is dealing with somebody's person or somebody's person is dealing with somebody friend i don't know what's this Okay, or it could be just take it where it resonates, okay? Yeah, so me at the bottom of the deck. So now I gotta use this. I gotta use these cards. Ain't none of your friends' business. Ain't none of your friends' business. Cause you know. Mm, 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 mm. Oh no. I'm telling you, somebody messing with somebody's friend. Ain't none of your friends' business. Ain't none of your friends' business. Okay, I don't know what this is. Yeah, it's like somebody came in with an offer. Y'all seen that nine knights of cups and then the four swords? It's like somebody came in with something with some bribery over the offer and told that person to keep it on the hush. Don't tell nobody. You can keep it between me and you. Okay, and this could be someone you married to, or or that's. That lives in a home with somebody. I don't know what this is. Four ones. They probably link up at hotels or meet up at. I don't know. This is just a hot mess. We're, let's see what's going on here. Ooh, I was trying to get y'all something different, but I guess we got to tap into this. Yeah, four swords. They wanted it on hush. Okay, telling somebody be quiet, don't say nothing. If this person asks you, say you don't know. Like, they want this person to lie to this person. So they won't find out. Because it's against the code. I heard something about the code. Oh, no. Nah. Five of Pentacles, three of Wands, five of Wands. Page of Wands. The person could have been younger than this person. Or older than this person. Or about around the same age group. They got some history with each other. With the Ten of Pentacles, that's a lot of history. That's a lot of time spent with one another. Okay? But you see how it's gapped out? So maybe it's at like... I couldn't even get it out. <laughs> it's at different times. But it's all gapped it out. And I don't know why I keep hearing that song. Ain't any of your friends business. Ain't any of your friends business. Then we got the page of ones, five of ones, three of ones. Somebody could have already discovered this message or seen a message, okay? And it went into a dispute with the five of ones, male or female, okay? This person was traveling to go see this person at a distance. This person could have also been helping this person. Let me hear you say. All right, let's get some more. Ten of Wands. It's a bunch of drama going on. 
Eight of Swords. Somebody lies is catching them to them. So whatever these lies, cries, and goodbyes is, is catching them to their ass. They can't seem to find their way out of it. I'm hearing if it's up, then it's stuck. Yeah, five of swords. Them lies catching up to them. And y'all heard the sirens in the background? That's confirmation. Yeah, seven of cups. Like somebody could have did this drunk. And then this ten of pentacles keep coming out. Five of pentacles, three of wands, king of swords. Could have been an air sign. Okay. Could have traveled. And got with somebody. But this been going on for quite some time. Okay. They do whatever they do with this seven of cups. I don't know if it's drinking, smoking, popping pills. Okay. Because it's an illusion. The seven of cups is an illusion. So it's like doing whatever it is that you can. For some form of self-gratification or self-satisfaction. I don't know what this is. Okay. Give me more. Whoa, this is a lot. Yeah, the five of wands, the page of pentacles, and the tower. Someone could have seen a message. The emperor, the moon, the seven of pentacles, the five of swords. Someone could have found receipts or seen receipts. Hidden receipts with the moon call and the seven of pentacles and the five of swords. As I said, somebody's getting caught up in a lie. All these lies, they kept continuing to say over and over it's starting to like be a delusion in their mind like they this person might have done this so much or try to get away with it so much that it's starting to be like what they say or how they say it or what they do or how they try to get away with it it just don't make sense it's backfiring like it just don't i don't know there's no other way i can say it. it just don't make sense this person is like Let's see. This is crazy. But it's like... I don't play this shit. Clay, don't play this shit. What's the five of ones? Nine of Pentacles. And it's like somebody be so guilty, they always pointing the finger and blaming other people. That's what this person be doing. But they be trying to like act like they don't know anything with the full swords. That's why I said it's like it's backfiring badly. Three of swords. Then we got the six. Look, the three of pentacles, six of pentacles, the magician, and the three of swords. This person could be having menage twins and shit like that and be getting paid for that's like some sexual cult going on over here with this shit the magician six of pentacles three of pentacles it could also be people around you trying to get in your business to gather information on you these people could be getting paid to get information on you that's why they're listening so goddamn hard and they paying attention so goddamn hard. What's this three of swords? Nine of cups and the six of cups. So it's either, take it where it resonates, male or female. They could be doing this shit when you sleep because my uh, reminder just came on talking about some bedtime. So this shit could be going on when you sleep. Yeah, four of swords. When this person be doing what they doing. And then when you figure out or you find out, it backfired and this person start blaming everything on you. To make you look like the bad guy. But this person's been doing sex rituals for a minute. Or whatever they into. What's this magician? It could be an air sign. 
I just keep hearing cult, cult, cult. What's this? What's the magician? King of Wands. Like wanting to, the Nine of Pentacles could be your identity as well. Everything that you didn't invested into yourself or put into yourself, all the time and energy you didn't put into yourself to become the Nine of Pentacles, is making people mad. Yeah, it's like they want to shut you up so bad because you're like literally putting people through tower moments right now. But remind you, these people was all about greed. Like, they wanted money, power, and respect so bad, but the way they got it was in the wrong way. Like, teaming up with other people to go against you. To, like, literally hurt you. And these people from your past. Oh, yeah, yeah. What's this King of Wands and the Magician? The Ace of Cups. Okay. <sighs> so this King of Wands, the clarify the magician, this person is manifesting a brand new beginning with you. With the Ace of Cups. Or well, you guys could just be in this King of Wands energy, male, female, taking action towards new love or putting yourself out there towards new love. Meeting new people through your pinnacles, Okay. Knowing what it is that you want, what you will, won't accept, okay? Knowing that you cannot give yourself away like you did in the past, okay? So if you are choosing to reunite, reconcile, or just go out and date and meet new people, okay? Yeah, enjoy yourself, be free, parlay, okay? Chill, relax, do whatever it is you need to do to continue to feel good and great about yourself 12, 12 o'clock, do it, okay? Don't let nobody stop you or block you, okay? I don't care what they say. Even if a person sit up here and sweat up and down, they about to um, do suicide, okay? You do that when I step off and when I leave. I ain't, I ain't got time for that. Because that's, that's that victim mentality sh stuff right there. I'm doing better, y'all. I had to catch myself. Let me catch my breath. Sorry, no. <laughs> I'm so lame, y'all, but it's like, I don't care because I'm me. What is this magician called? Three of Wands. Yeah, this person could want to travel to come see you. Two of Swords. But they could feel like it's... Mm. Like, it could be something in their way. What is the magician? The Ace of Swords. Okay. So someone could be trying to like manifest or build up their energy to put the effort in to come towards you. We got two, well, three threes out here. So it could be something about a third party. It's over, it's ending, it's done. Okay, oh, this person is just tired of giving in to everyone else. You or this person, take away, resonate. Y'all just tired of giving in to these people, places and things. And y'all ready to manifest something new. And you don't care how harsh it come off or how harsh it, it, it becomes with the Ace of Swords. Because this is like a harsh truth, a harsh realization right here. The Ace of Swords. Because it gets straight to the point. It stays facts. It's not being all around the bush and shit like this five of ones. You got to fight and be around all these different people, places, and things just to get to one particular thing. Like, no. What we're going to do is... Either get in the towel and jump out of it, or we're just going to walk away from the towel. Because you could be guided away from a towel. But most people like to be in the towel and go out the towel. Like, no. <clears throat> it's like this person is receiving. Hold on, Zoe, please. This person is receiving a lot of synchrony. Can you wait a second, please? Thank you. 
This person is receiving a lot of synchronicities, downloads, and messages. Because this give me like a lot of messages coming in. And it's like this person is taking heed to it with the five swords in their hand, but the two is still down. So it's like this person is having to like really thoroughly re like rechase re retrace their steps. What's the seven of swords? But we're gonna see before I talk too soon. Or you're being protected from this person because there's something deceptive going on about this person. This person could either be a distraction or they're actually someone that's meant to come into your life. Okay? So nowadays, it's to the point where you got a real lot of questioning people's motives. And my ears ringing. And this go for whatever. Any relationship you get into, any new connection you get into, just sit down and ask people, like, what is your real intentions? What is your real motives? Like, <laughs> like what is it that you want to invest and work towards and build and create? Okay? In order for it to be the Ten of Pentacles, because we've seen the Ten of Pentacles that came out twice at the beginning of the reading. Like, you, we really got to get to... The, the 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 root of the scenario here or the, the the problem because not everybody is good for you yeah full cuts sometimes these missing missed opportunities sometimes this rejection is God protection that's why the tempers out here because this person is going through something that's leading them in a tower moment but this could be your twin because I seen the two of cups baby girl baby girl Go over there. What's this seven of swords? What's this seven of swords? Major betrayal. It's an ending going on with this person. Or about to. Or this person could be in this seven of swords energy and ten of swords energy. Feeling betrayed, feeling deceived, feeling tricked. So this masculine is feeling tricked. What's this three of swords? Whoever is in this king of cups energy, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, or this person can have it anywhere in the chart, or Sagittarius, okay? Or Scorpio. What's this three of swords? But this three of swords came out with this person from the... So this person is protecting themselves from you because they caught something from somebody in the past that was very selfish. This person could have thought that that's why we have let your friends help you unrequited love. That's why I picked up on sex with a friend. If somebody did something with somebody's friend, it caused, it caused a big-ass argument. And then it was like this person will make up excuses or do this when they was when they drunk and they would go take trips with this person and travel with this person and meet up with this person. But it could have been for some type of like exchange with the six of pentacles. This person used to make it seem like that they were single, but overall they was married or in a relationship or they was in a commitment. Okay, yeah, four of wands, the food. This person was living life freely, friskly, frivolity. Yeah, the world called something is over, it ended. And this masculine is holding their energy back because they have to. Hey, no, 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 no. Wrong way, buckos. Yeah, the queen of wands and the star, this person feel like you can heal them. Something gone bad because this might have wands in reverse. Like that's that hold on y'all. Two of cups, eight of pentacles.
Y'all gotta learn too. Consequences. <laughs> the same way we had to learn it, y'all had to learn it. When somebody tell y'all sit down, it's meant to sit down. Okay? Y'all gotta learn it. 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 Y'all gotta You don't need it that loud. You can hear it. And another thing, if it's like you just been feeling like your kids been doing way too much out of the ordinary, like shit they wouldn't even do, like to the point to where it's starting to aggravate and irritate you, that's people that are sending those, <sighs> sending it to you. Okay, to make your kids act all crazy and all out the ordinary or just be doing stuff they never did. Hello. Alright. What's this night of wands? But yes, everything is consequences, y'all. We gotta <laughs> at some point in time it's like that life we used to live or that life we used to do is not there no more. Like staying the same only makes your like it only lowers your life. It does. Like, I don't know. I, I put a reading up some days ago. Like, you got to choose. Is it? Anyway, what's this Knight of Wands in reverse? Justice. Oh, so this is person's karma. Get strength in the sun and judgment. Maybe it's, this was this happened to teach this person about discipline, about structure, about the about your um, the purity of your body, the essence of your body and your sexual energy and where it goes. Because Leo energy is all about passion. It's, it's fire energy. So that's the sexual organs. That's the sexual energy. Also, your heart. I'm not even about to say that. I don't like when I be getting too deep in the stuff because I don't be one to like. Mm -mm. Anyway, yeah, but this is person of justice, the nine of nine of wands in reverse. Life that caught up with you at some point. <clears throat> yeah, the death card, seven of cups. This person could have been very sexual and don't know where they got it from. So that's why they're holding back. Because it's a lot of confusion and chaos around this situation. Like stuff is blowing up in this person's face. I guess because this person is like, okay, I already, I have everything alone. Nine of Pentacles, Nine of Cups, like something definitely came to an end. And it's definitely dealing with somebody's sexual health, their physicality, as well as spiritually. So this person could have came off like the King of Wands or Incubus or whatever the case may be. Like very sexual, very attractive, very alluring, okay? Very charming. Knew how to like get things hot and ready. It seems like it rains, it seems like it rains. 
And now, because this person went through this bad experience dealing with sex, it, it's, 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 it's sitting this person down. Because this person, home, they moved off of sex. They moved their whole, they just moved off of passion. So this could be a Leo, a Scorpio, a Libra. A Sagittarius, a Cancer, because this person was very sexual. King of Wands. That's how they move. That's how they operate. Because they look good, and their appearance and who they were. And when whatever this is with the past, with this three of swords, seven of swords, ten of swords, is major betrayal, or maybe this person just continued to stay. The way that they were in their past life, okay? Playing, playing from the Himalayas, clearing people in competition, wondering how they can get either too, being single, living a fast life, the good life, having it up, giving, doing, going out, drinking, chilling, smoking, parlaying, doing whatever. And the ugly truth came in and slapped this person in the face. And now they're holding back for pinnacles. So if you and this person keep. It's like on and off communication or just no communication at all. This is because this person is going through this tower moment. But it's like this person had to realize and differentiate the two. This was this person's lesson. Love or lust. Which one is it? How are you going to move and operate? Because lust don't get you nowhere but a disease... A, a whole bunch of kids, a whole bunch of babies. This person could have made kids wherever and what. I don't know. This person probably do got a child somewhere. And they run off, sneak off, cut these people off, don't talk to them, act like they don't know them. This person could be going to court for child support, three swords. It's an ending going on. And now this person ain't got no choice but to be in their emotions and feelings. I don't know who this is. Okay? But just only take the messages that resonate. King of Pentacles, Two of Swords. Maybe this person feel like you're not going to want to deal with them. Like, this person had a lot of harsh lessons they needed to learn. Yeah, because they were stuck in that toxic energy. Because they was wounded. They was holding on to wounds from their childhood. Whether it's sexual abuse, uh, drug abuse, something. I don't know why I just jumped like that, y'all. My ear was just starting to ring. We got judgment. So I guess um, spirit will give this person a second chance if they actually change their ways and get their soul together and stop chasing after their sexual desires, urges, wants, or needs, like temptation. The person has a hard time with temptation, with taming it, or, or finding discipline and structure. And this person would give to any and everybody. They didn't care. Nine of cups, six of pentacles. If they got it, they willing to give. Like this person was just doing a lot. That's why the tower moment is out here. And this person probably sitting there asking themselves like, why I didn't stop when I had a chance? Or why I keep continuing to do the same stuff over and over and over? Because this person is not talking to you at all. What's this ten of swords? What's this ten of swords? The fool, I'm telling you. This person was just doing too much. Doing way too much. And that's the truth with the ace of swords. <clears throat> this person is healing now, okay? So this person could be a natural healer like you as well. King of Wands and the star. But that's it don't stop this person from learning their lesson. 
because this is a lesson that this person needed to learn. Okay, about keep continuing to, what did it say? I'm just thinking with my dick. My shit done. Okay, the Kevin Gates song. That, it was love or lust. Then again, take it where it resonates. This could be somebody from your past that's going through this situation and you need to stay away from this person. Okay, because they keep trying to come in your energy and have a new beginning with you or reach out to you and talk to you. But this person's health is not up to par. Okay, so you take it where it resonates and then you got a fire sign that want to come in towards you that, that that's manifesting you. Okay, with the Ace of Cups. Okay, or it could be a Libra, a Scorpio, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Sagittarius, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. It could be either one of those signs. Okay, you guys take the messages where it resonates. Okay, but your past person isn't doing so good health wise, so I advise you to stay away. And you ain't gotta believe me, male or female, but you will believe it when you get hit with the shawami or you wonder why you got a hit. Okay, so make sure you guys like, share, comment, and subscribe, and hit that bell notification so you know when you're gonna post it. Peace.